morning reception. Thanks for coming to our maths lesson today. Now in our maths lesson today, there will be two parts. This first part is about what we can remember. In the second part of the video, I'll tell you what you need for our main lesson. Okay, so to start off with, we are going to be doing some supertizing. Can you say that word? Supertizing. Super job. Oh, look who's come to look who's come to join us today. It's Bertie. Oh, do you want to say something? Bertie wasn't here when we learned about supertizing. He doesn't know what it means. Well, Bertie, whenever we do supertizing, I always get out my drum. So I'm going to get my drum. Now, if you've got a drum, you can go and get one. If you haven't got your drum, that's okay. You can do it on your knees. So here's my drum. It's a really big drum today. Look, I've had a really big drum. So I'm going to pop it on the table. And then we're going to do our chant. Are you ready? So Bertie, we go, super ties, super ties, super ties. Can you do that reception? Are you ready? Super ties, super ties. Good job. Now, oh, Bertie's got another question. Let's see. Oh, Bertie said he really likes all the drumming, but he still doesn't know what super ties means. If you think you can remember what super ties means, I want you to pause the video and tell your teddy, tell your helper, or tell us on the screen. Good job. Super ties, Bertie, is when you see. An amount, there might be pictures, there might be objects, and your brain just knows how many are there without counting them. So I could do that. I could show you some fingers, or oh, which way do we go? There we go. And you, if you super ties, you don't have to count them, you just know how many are there. So, Bertie, how many fingers am I holding up? That's right, three, and you didn't even have to count them. So you supertized the amount of fingers I've got. So last time we did supertizing reception, we looked at some Numicon and we looked at some objects. Well, today we're going to do it a little bit differently. We're going to look at supertizing on a tens frame. So let me show you one. So here's my tens frame. I've got 10 spaces all together. So the most I can have is 10. How many blue dots have I got? That's right, we've got four. I can see that we've got, where am I? One, two, three, four. Four. Let's try another one. Five. Well done. Remember, we're not counting them first of all. So first of all, you're looking and seeing how many you think there are. Five. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. That's right. And there's the same number of blank spaces up there. Oh, so that tells me that five and five make how many? That's right, they make ten. Oh, let's have a little look. Remember, don't count them. How many are there all together? Six. That's right. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, Bertie's got a question. Bertie wants to know how we knew there were six all together here. How did we know? What numbers can you see here? And what do you know about them? What links can you make? Pause the video now. Well, Bertie, I can see, I know I've got four there and I know I've got two. I can see I've got four and two. So my brain knows if I bring those together, if I combine them, that makes six. Four and two make six. And my brain is starting to just know that. I know that if I've got four and a two all together, I've got six. Six. Good job. Five. Let's see. One, two, three, four, 
five. Now, what numbers did you see within this? I saw a four and a one, and that makes five. That's how my brain did it. How did your brain do it? Some of you might have seen two and three, and you know that that makes five. Some of you might have just seen five. Eight. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now again, what numbers did you see within this? I saw a four and another four, like two dice. A four there and a four there. And my brain knows that a four and a four make eight. What did your brain do? So many different ways that our brains can work. Eight. Let's see. I'm going to hold it up this way. Seven. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven dots all together. What numbers did you see? I saw a four and a three. And my brain knows that four and three make seven. You might have seen a six, like the dice, and a one. And you know that six and one more is seven. You might, some of you might have thought, oh, if we had another one there, that would be eight. And one less than eight is seven. Aren't our brains clever? I'm going to quickly show you one more in a different way. So this is one we've already seen, but I'm going to show you in a different way. Six. Well, um, even if it's like this, what if it's like that? Still six. Five. What if we turn it around? Five. Still five. Still five. Super job. Well done for doing our supertizing in part one of our maths video. Now, tune in to part two, where we're going to be looking at the word subtraction. Oh, that's such a big word. See you in a minute.